The Titanic was thought to be unsinkable, the safest ship on the seas. Now, maybe it was the greed and arrogance of the company that built the ship. I don't know. But what we do know is it has become known as the most famous sinking ship. Well, that narcissist in your life believes they are also unsinkable. They display the same kind of arrogance promoted about the Titanic. For example, you could be out for a nice romantic dinner. Oh, music, candles, ambiance, all of that. And they just start a heated argument out of thin air. Like, what, what are you doing? Accusing you of being selfish, inconsiderate. Oh, and then here come the accusations about your cheating again. Okay. Always talking behind their back, right? And telling you that you never truly loved them anyway. And now, after you've experienced all of this verbal abuse, you can come away feeling like you're the one sinking. And then you do what? You attempt to do what you always do. Defend yourself against these ridiculous accusations, telling them, I love you. What are you talking about? And by the end of the night, you end up feeling exhausted, defeated and discouraged. Well, one strategy you should consider is to let the narc tire themselves out. Imagine a boxer swinging with all of their might. Oh, trying to knock your head off. But guess what? All you do is, yeah, you just, just dodge every blow. Eventually, they will tire themselves out and just, boom, drop from exhaustion. That's the equivalent to you not reacting to the narc's attack as they bust a blood vessel due to your lack of response, then getting upset and storming off because you refuse to engage. You've exhausted no energy whatsoever, but they end up sabotaging themselves because you didn't take the bait. Like scripture says, let the wicked fall into their own nets. And in this case, it is their own arrogance that makes them sink. Now, you may say, Doc, I feel like I got a hole in my boat. I feel like I'm sinking. Every attack, every insult is too much. I tell you what, don't you worry about it. I get it. Go to my website, ChristopherReed.org, schedule your free 30-minute consultation so you and I can have that conversation. And I'm going to tell you how coaching is going to help you keep your peace, keep your boat afloat. Y'all take care. Peace.